Alright everyone, this is Have No Pity, and unfortunately I will be casting a 4v5 tonight between C69 and W. Uh, this is an uh, EST Monday Week 5 match in the RD2L Season 4. Uh, Cloud69 was unfortunately unable to get a 5th player by the start time, but they both teams decided they just play a 4v5 game anyways. So, Radiance ban. let's let the game start. Um, the like and ban out. This is um, becoming a little less common. Radiance like ban. Got nerfed a little bit, uh, but still a very strong hero. A lot of teams are still using him. Uh, the PA ban out. That's very Eternal Envy esque. Dyer's ban. The mid recently. Um, the okay. The Meepo Radiance ban out pick. is a little strange. The um, and the Ember Spirit yeah. ban out. These guys are just picking too fast. I can't even commentate this Dyer's draft. Dyer's pick. Um, but let's see, Keep Your Light got the Ags upgrade, which is pretty sweet. Uh, Luna, pretty strong Radiance hero for pick. pushing, for farming. She can basically just do it all. She's a very safe carry to pick. And Dazzle is, in my opinion, one of the strongest defensive supports in the game. Shallow Grave is just an incredible spell, and you really force the other team to focus on the Dazzle and the team fights. So, uh, let's see how well they can play that out for the rest of the game. Uh, Cloud69 really thinking about this second pick. Uh, I don't know if they're going to do any combo, but no, we see a Tree Protector. Um, Radiance ban. Very strong hero. Pilot Eye pay, plays him incredibly effectively uh, for Cloud9. Um, but very strong uh, lane. Radiance ban. The nice thing about their supports right now is they can put Tree into the lane and they can really jungle the Keeper. Dyer's ban. Uh, now we see the... Uh, Dyer's pick. The Weaver and the Slark ban outs, both kind of I mid game slash late game if they get snowballing. Radiance uh, pick. High DPS heroes. And we see the Wisp and Wisp the uh, Bristleback ban outs. Immediately followed by a Nature's Prophet pickup. So this is going to be a ratting, split pushing team. Uh, Wraith King Radiance uh, pick. picked up for Cloud 69. Kind of, you can either carry or support him. This is obviously going to be a core Wraith King. Remember, they only have four players. So they're going to have a dual lane bottom i assume because they're on oh excuse me they're on dire i always forget that this i think it flips for this i don't remember the the draft one of the screens is a little messed up so they can put their keeper of the light in dark. their off lane uh oh, never mind it'll be dark seer in the off lane i guess a uh, actually they could, they could have just not shown a hero yet because they're only playing four um we see the shadow demon pick up uh interesting uh, he's a fine hero good Good support, but I don't really know. He doesn't really combo with anything. Right now. I guess you can pick. tree people in with Nature's Prophet, which is fine. Uh, you can also use him to uh, duplicate Luna's Illusions, which is pretty good. So this is a very pushy Axe. lineup. Um, and Axe, there's the the Radiance uh, pick, uh, Creep Skipper, uh, the the quick pressure. So they're trying to put a lot of pressure early, and I think that's fine. I mean, this is a four v five game. It's kind of for fun, anyways. So, Shadow Shaman. Shaman, the last pickup. I do not know how uh, Cloud69 wants to lane this. Let's see what they decide to do for game number zero, we'll call it, in this best of two matchup, which is, I believe, going to turn into a one game matchup. And actually, if I know the rules correctly, which I believe I do, uh, at this point, Cloud9 has already, or Cloud69, I should not call him Cloud9, Cloud69 has already forfeited both games. But. Maybe not. They might need get to wait 15 minutes. Um, I don't really care. I'm going to cast it. So again, this is Have No Pity. Uh, all my VODs go up on YouTube. Uh, Twitch or YouTube.com forward slash Have No Pity. Uh, it's just the best place to store them all. Obviously, we're going to have to wait the full time for <laughs> Cloud69 to not pick Shadow Shaman. Um, 10 seconds to go. So let's run through the heroes real quick. Uh, Cloud69 is on the Radiant. We have Kamika or Kai Kamikaze playing the Tree Protector. Don't know where Places he's going everyone. to that. Uh, ESJ goes playing the Keeper of the Lights. Mr. Clean, uh, the Captain, is playing the Darkseer in the safe lane. And we have the Ace uh, top as the Wraith King. And let me real quick just turn down my... Um, camera speed a little bit. That way I don't jerk around as much for you guys. Okay, and we see... <laughs> is this a level 1 Roche, or is it just a jungle? Nope, it's a level 1 Roche coming out from W. Because why not? Uh, it's going to be the Luna in there with her damage ore, the trees. They should be able to take this, no problem. Uh, Axe is a pretty good tank for this. 
Um, he gets uh, counter helix. I think this is pretty good. Pings come out, so I don't know if they saw it. They're thinking about going, but it's 4v5. Like, they can't take a fight now. 30 seconds to show uh, More trees created. Uh, they're going to be in this pit. Our barcode is taking a lot of damage on that axe, but... Um, yeah, this is going to be no problem. Uh, they're actually going to go out of the pit now. They dodged the uh, blast from Kahlo, who... He's going to have no mana. He's got one more blast in him. Um, this Roche is going to go down pretty quickly. We do have a, a ward out for the Dire, so they see everything that's going here. Another blast comes in, uh, but that's going to be a tickle on Mr. Clean. Uh, he doesn't go. have to pull his axe, which makes this very hard to do. A stun comes out on axe, but he's going to counter helix it out. A uh, good heal from Dazzle. Uh, there goes one. First blows down. We're going to try to get barcode down. He does go down, but there's going to pay the Wraith King for it. and It's going to be a 3 4 1. And they should be able to walk in and get Roshan. La la la, says Mr. Clean. And here they go with Roshan effort. Uh, they don't have the axe attack it now. Uh, he, Dark light. he gets some trees up. Uh, there they come. come to me. Radiant's immediately rushing in again. Uh, they could really use barcode here. Uh, one ping comes out from the ace, but it's not shattered. Uh, and this is going to be the Roshan. I assume they're going to give it to Luna. Um, why not? Uh, the lanes are engaging, so they're losing out on experience. A good disrupt, but he does not dodge the stun. A blast comes through and ends up getting dazzled, but Luna does get the rush. And now they're going to pay. I don't know why they ran in there. Uh, the ace is going to die right here. He goes down. Uh, Kai Kamikaze is running away with the dazzle shell. It's going to be kind of hard to kill. They do have a pull, though. Eight seconds. This blast is going to come through and do, well, not a lot of damage. Uh, there's the, uh, the, uh, Soul Catcher is out. There's the pull. Um, oh, man, that tree, uh, lead seed's so good. But Luna might be able to get the kill here if she can get some vision. I believe she has a Lucid Beam. She does. There's the vision. Uh, not going to be enough. Uh, I, they're going to turn around, maybe? Uh, they don't. The creeps are here. This is going to be a fighting game. Oh, losing Beam? Nope, nope. Tickled by the creeps. Uh, she's going to have to run away. So two for four is going to be the end of that exchange in this 4v5 matchup. Uh, no one's in lanes. Actually, no. Smiles has decided I'm going to actually do what I'm supposed to be doing and lane this guy. Uh, he's going to be getting some quick experience up. Um, what a game indeed. Radiant's tough towers in bad what shape. A game. I really hope they can get their fifth for the new game. Um, I really want to cast a good game. And the problem with uh, people not having uh, teammates show up is first thing, you have So it's kind of frustrating as a caster. The second thing is all the games start at the same time. So I can't switch games if I'm in this game trying to, trying to uh, Trouble brewing at Radiant's bottom tower. But anyways, you're going to see the creep skipping. This tower is going to go down really fast. I hope this game only takes 15 or 20 minutes, honestly. Radiant's I bottom see a tower game. ain't a pretty sight right now. Uh, here comes the Dazzle, but what is he really going to do? Uh, if this axe can get a fast blink, he's going to be a happy man. Trouble um, brewing at Radiant's bottom tower. Meanwhile, dual lane tops. The Smiles is going to get a leech seed. If he dies here, that's going to be a shame. Uh, he is not enough mana for his uh, stun, but is it going to matter? Radiant's bottom tower uh, seen better days. It is going to matter. If he did that stun, it would have been the kill. But Dyer's mid towers have to technical home. difficulties. Meanwhile, bottom tower is Radiant's be bottom a tower ain't a tower. pretty sight right now. My companion would be very happy if this was actually happening. Um, we have the ward that's going to end up doing nothing. They're not going to need this ward at all. Um, Ping's coming out on Mr. Clean. Trying to creep skip. You've been out creep scupped by the scupper. The scupper himself. Uh, mid lane is turning into Luna's Western versus ES Jago on the hat adorned coddle. Um, and this should go. <laughs> where, where do I go? I don't know, my friend. Jungle. Uh, but here go the creeps. This really should be tower. Uh, Trouble yeah, brewing at Radiant's gonna bottom try tower. Try to get the uh, last hit here. Nope, he misses it. So slight mistakes. Uh, Barco doing a good job. Creep skipping top lane. They might sack this tower. They do have trees there, but Dyer's it's not doing top a great job of pulling. Needs to get those trees coming back. Uh, they should really just switch their trial lane to top, but they're just going to push bottom. The they're going to force uh, Cloud69 to rotate around, which is not a, not a bad idea. Uh, the Aegis is going to be reclaimed in three minutes. Watch out. Better get some use out of that. Dyer's top tower. Um, you know the drill. Radiant's bottom um, tower in a pretty sad so right Axe is leading. Uh, Mr. Clean's going to get away here. If we take a look at here. Level. Eh, it's... No, Radiant's so bottom easy. tower seem better days. Battle, right? That would have been a nice thing to have. Um, XP per minute doesn't matter. Net worth. 
strongly in favor of Axe with those two kills. Um, Radiant's just, bottom tower I'm not ain't even pretty look at sight right let's now. Let's uh, GPM. Actually, let's look at uh, fantasy points. Come to Axe! Big blast comes through. Uh, I'm just going to these kills up. Uh, J ES Jago might... No, he's not going to die here. If Axe can get in there and get a pull, which he can't, he just walk, just follow, Radiant's just follow, bottom just follow, tower seem better days. Pull. There it is. And that's going to be a Mr. Clean. Uh, barcode. Good job of skipping size. here. Um, run away. Run away. Run away. Uh, Trouble could heal brewing that radiant bottom get this tower. tower. You might be able to. Mm. Top tower smiles just kind of. Hey, if anyone, if anyone else is goofing around, I'm just going to get some XP. And that's what he does. Barcode back full health now with some good support from Dazzle. Uh, where is our fifth player? He's Radiant's mid tower is getting banged up. Is he going Midas? I think he should go Midas. Uh, barcode doing his axe thing. This is going to be a really fast tower. Again. Radiant blast bottom tower ain't a pretty level one sight blast. right now. Level three blast. Level five god. Well, that's a lot of damage. Holy cow. Um, <laughs> it's going to be enough to make axe back. And this is going to slow down this push immediately. Kai Kamikaze is hanging out in the trees, trying to get some XP. Uh, they're rotating mid now, going to try to get that mid tower. I would have stayed at this bottom tower, but they know that this coddle is just going to be able to keep the lane pushed out. Um, Axe is trying to get level 6, I assume? Yeah, he is. Um, very close. Uh, close to a... Actually, he could have a Vanguard right now. I might be flying it out to himself. Nope, Soul Ring's coming out, but they're going to be able to get Mr. Clean. No problem. This guy is just having a tough time with Darks here. Uh, Dazzle Heal comes out, and this Luna is one happy Luna. Dyer's mid tower won't last much longer. Meanwhile, top lane. I keep going here because this is, I guess, the only real lane that's happening. Um, the Ace is taking a lot of damage from these Treants. Well, that's okay. Uh, we do have an ultimate up for Smiles, so he could... Oh, but they have a tree, of course. No fun tree. Um, hopefully we're going to see a mid tower from Sats soon. Sats team. I believe Sats the captain. Um, and yeah, they're pushing down the tower. Uh, bottom gets pinned Somebody's out by cooking. Coddle. Oh, Axe gets a kill? I didn't even see that. Radiant's mid tower is coming apart. Top tower now. There he is. So Axe is top now, putting a lot of pressure on top tower with the pushing power of this Furion. Should be able to do this no problem. So they split the axe top. They put Luna down bottom to farm. Totally, totally legit, guys. Radiant's top tower. Uh, mid tower is now a four v or a three v two, and this is gonna be bad. Dazzle I was melts. Uh, Radiant's top tower is taking. So hits. and yeah, just to remind everyone, this game is a four v five. Cloud sixty nine could not get five players to show up out of their eight. So, Radiant's top tower is taking hits. Pro Doge's from it by Sat here. He's, I, that's some of the best Dyer's dodging I've seen. Could use a little help. His team had TP'd in, in and helped him. Yes, indeed, Sat. Some solid Radiant's juice. bottom solid tower juice. seen better days. Dyer's mid yes, tower but, won't last. Reminder much for everyone who's watching uh, it's the 4v5, so obviously it's not going to count for anything. Trouble brewing at Radiant's bottom tower. Which I would have liked to know before I got in this lobby. But that's okay. Mid -tower so we do see the minus hell. out on Smiles. Playing legit Dota. Uh, Can't do nothing. The entire about Dyer's Cloud 6 9 right team now. of four Dyer's players mid mid pushing hard. Technical trying to get some equalization here. Bottom tower seen um, better days. Axe does not have blink yet. Oh, he nope, doesn't have blink. He just walked back. No, he does have blink. I just Dyer's didn't hear him. Mid no, he's not getting now. the spins. He's going to die. Axe goes down. Tower. That is called yeah, unlucky Dotas. Or lucky Dotas if you're uh, Cloud 69. Six stacks and tree protector. I don't even know how much damage that is. Seven stacks. He just dies. Don't Trouble underestimate those, those stacks, tower. my friend. Oh, and T is gonna go in here and try to get a kill. I think towers. he has a stun. He does have a stun in two seconds. One second. Zero seconds. Radiant's nine top minutes. Tower is in bad shape. Uh, he melts. Uh, Mr. Queen's on the high ground. Uh, the stun does come out. Well, he might pay with uh, cannot ultimate. He has no mana. He goes down. Meanwhile, Mr. Clean gets out. Port Wraith Knight, indeed. Uh, the Aegis is going to be back. I don't know what that means. A very long time. Okay, W, let's go. Let's get some kills. He's fighting Dota. There's no time for standard Dota here. Get this mid tower. So, they're going to push mid here. 
Um, but they have a tree, which Radiance is, mid -tower is could use a hand. in all of Dota, other than Naga Siren. Uh, we see four mid, but we see a wraparound coming here from the Zax. He does blink in. He does get two, uh, but not the spins he needs again. A good heal from Dazzle is going to try to do it. Is he going to dunk? No, he's going to dunk. Oh, no, the Dazzle, he, the Dazzle of Shadow Grip comes up, but he gets blocked in by his team. There goes uh, uh, the Dazzle. There goes the Axe. Two down. <laughs> We got two Shadow Poison stacks. Do so you remember what happens if you stack this much Shadow Poison? But this time he has enough mana. There's three stacks. There's four stacks. There's five stacks. Oh, he dies. Is rich. But he was too close. Too close to the sign. You need to disrupt yourself, sir. He ends up dodging both the stun and the uh, blast. So that's actually pretty good. The axe is going to be there to throw some damage. He gets a pull on uh, the ace. They can get this kill. That'll be worth the trade. Dyer's mid tower really right is so that's going to be an open three. Team fight trade. If only it had to be on the summit. Uh, team fight indicator. Uh, there's the pilot die slow, just punching to death. Dazzles there with no shallow grave. Three seconds, two seconds, one second. Somebody's barcode is on dead. Two towers taking hits. So uh, barcode is doing well, but can the feed a little bit? Yeah. Radiant's right. top tower is in bad shape. But that's fine. Western Dyer's mid top. tower won't uh, last much longer. Taking a little bit of creep aggro there, or tower aggro there, but does end up getting the radiant lost the shape. top tower. They don't really care. They're just gonna push into base, and they can push faster. Dyer's mid level tower four could trees. use a little help. Level four trees and Luna with her bouncing glaives at two. Plus Luna radiant's aura. top tower is in bad so, shape. So here we go. They're going high ground. Uh, Dyer's mid tower has four. Four. all Nine technical difficulties. On. Uh, I must die the tier two, but they do end up getting a shadow hit. So there's that. Um, this tower is going to go down. There is a glyph Radiant fortification. structures must have been fortified. Uh, but is anyone going to TP? It doesn't matter. Uh, trees are up now. He has, he can cast them, and he does. And that's going to be the tier five two. in a row. Three, excuse me. <laughs> Meanwhile, their entire team is dying shape. dead. One last top tower um, for the radiant. But I'm not going to watch that. Dyer's uh, mid tower is having technical difficulties. Mid, uh, a buyback the first from Axe and TCN. Radiant's he really gonna, he's going to die again. Oh, Dyer's yeah. mid tower will last much longer. But, uh, it's not going to matter. The, the poisons are coming through. They're starting to Radiant's stack, but uh, Axe is going to die again. So long the Radiant's dieback and the blast. The Shadow Demon is going to save himself for a few seconds. Seven and row. three dead. Two dead. Radiant's top Rax ain't going to last might die long. As well. They're gonna really lose Dyer's this mid tower could use a little help. Dagger, uh, but they do get the, the radiance top. They might Rags trade their mid tower. So. Looks like they won't. Uh, they take down a quarter of the team in Darkseer, uh, and they're back. They're back to uh, to be about to be two mid. So now we'll go back to the Dyer's mid tower could use a little help. The Shadow Blade is up. Uh, he's thinking about it. He's thinking about it. There's the attack. Uh, tree and Protector Punch is pretty hard, man. Tree and Protector Punch is pretty hard. There's the Blast that tickles him. Um, but he's faster. Oh, there's the Mana Leak. That's going to be a big play. Oh, Shallow Grave is there. Is he going to be able to CP? Oh, the Axe Blink. Oh, no. The Blast Through? Is he going to Blast Through? And no. They do get the Soul Catcher on him. And Kai Kami, Kazi Kama is going to go down, but Smiles is going to die first. Goes down to Disrupt from Sat, does go down. Um, the Shadow Poisons are starting to get stacked. It's not enough. Keeps the Light does go down from his Wicked Seat 6 streak. No Carry Keeper. Axe points in the wrong direction, but it doesn't matter. He's trying to kill the whole team. It's not going to happen. Two That's two down. <laughs> So out we march. Uh, barcode leading the way. Uh, are they going to go for Roshan? I believe they are. Dead tree. Luna with Blink Dagger. This is not a thing you see very often. But I guess she just is trying to game. Uh, that Invis Rune not going to help you kill Roshan. Oh. Radiant's uh, mid tower is getting banged uh, up. About to die to Roshan. Those bash hits. Um, here they come. Oh, they trap in Who's Barcode. Poor guy. Um. Meanwhile, here they go smashing away, slicing and dicing. That's going to be different now, pretty quickly. And then they should just please go mid and win. You're going to have six lives to four. That's a pretty solid advantage. He has been dying a lot recently, so it's probably a good pickup. He ends up blinking and pulling and then not getting the RNG, which happens to the best of us. Um... 
Oh, here they go. The pull misses uh, the ace, which is not good. His stun is still available. They're going to get sat here. Huge blast comes through. The stun is ready for him. He does have the Aegis up, but, I mean, he's going to die once. Uh, Mr. Clean should be able to... Oh, oh excuse me. Speed someone up. The stun's going to be there. He does have... He does have the blink. They were not able to do any damage to him for three seconds. But C69, going to try to go high ground here, maybe? Uh, the Shadow Demon's down, which is puts them in even footing. Here comes the blast. Oh, looks like Cuddle has no ages. It's just his uh, Dyer's mid tower won't last much longer. They are gonna get this. Them nope, there goes the fortification. Here they come. Uh, Sat's walking out. Where's Luna? Oh, Luna's pushing him bottom. Doing the Dyer's responsible thing. Oh, you think the trigger is going to do that? There comes the big blast. The TPM by Axe. The pull he gets three this time is going to get the RNG. No, the mech is there to save everyone. Another big blast is going to come through. That's going to be the ages at least. Uh, two supports take a lot of damage. The back in is might be able to get uh, uh, Dazzle here. Dazzle is going to have to grade himself. Uh, he does not grade himself. Uh, Axe gets two pulled. That's five stacks. There's one dead. There's two dead. Oh, there's the Junkaroo. Oh, but it doesn't matter. There's the stun. Boop. Dead. That's a lot of armor up on those guys. Ain't looking good for the guys. So gonna try to get the ace. Oh, the flinky from Luna, and there's the blink ultimate of Melts. Big plays by Luna. <laughs> Dyer's mid racks is getting swamped. Did you turn cheats on? Why does he have so much gold? Dyer's mid racks ain't doing so hot. All right, so out he goes. Uh, they're finally going to get this tier two mid. Warriors Hopefully. of the wood. Radiant's mid tower could use a hand. So that's going to be mid tower. Uh, we got Mr. Clean going out mid. Radiant's with, toughened up got their amount of items. I guess they're Radiant's getting mid gold tower is getting banged team. up. Um, and we have our friend Sat walking out, master of the shadow poison stacks. Radiant's mid tower is coming apart. Shadow has an armlet, does he really? Yes, he does. Best item on that. Uh, Radiant's mid tower here. ain't doing so good. Luna, that blast, man. Um, the ace is yourself. thinking of blinking about and trying to get a stun, but he only has an armlet. He does not have a blink dagger, which would be really nice. Um, are they going to be able to get anything else high ground? It doesn't look like it. They might be able to get bark, but there comes a the stun. Oh, he blink jukes it. Barely in time. This Shadow Point stack's trying to come out. Not going to be enough. Illusion from Luna. Oh, I missed Dazzle going down. Um, so, C69 actually organizing their fights pretty well for 4v5. Is they going to be able to get the stun? Nope. Uh, well, I guess it was up. Oh, we do get two high ground wards here, just in case. You know, two eyes. See? Are they synchronized? No, I guess they're not synchronized. Are they? No, they're not synchronized. Okay. Zero armor. Tough, tough to be awarded. Uh, Cloud 69 marching mid. Kai Kamikaze and the ace is going down. Supermax is going to have to die sometime. Um, yeah, could could in fact die sometime. They're splitting up, guys. Just just win the game. You have you have five. What's Luna doing? Oh, farming. Luna, I assume, is farming, farming an Ag Scepter straight. Uh, she's only 400 gold off of it. Um, whoop. Let's just take a look real quick. I don't actually know exactly what Ag Scepter does. Um, I assume it just increases the number of beams. That would make sense. All right, so we have Smiles pushing in top, just, again, for fun. Mirvax is, meanwhile, taking a lot of damage. Uh, blink in my axe a pull, but as we know, the RNG for axe has been terrible this game. Um, a heal comes out from Dazzle, Radiance but only hits three things, coming so not a huge heal. Big blast comes through. Does this... Nope, no axe up here. I was trying to get it. Axe gets a pull, but also gets a mana leak. If he gets Radiance moving, he's going to get stunned. Uh, the, stun, the slow up by Dazzle, they're not going to go on axe. He's going to try to get these. But meanwhile, in the back end, Sat uh, slowing everyone down with his ultimate. Three stacks on Jango. He needs to get out of there. Uh, if there's one thing we've learned, if these stacks hurt... He does get away. Um, High Kamikaze is going to go down to Luna, no doubt. Uh, does get the slow, though, so that's going to be a lot of uh, hit points coming back. Dyer's here. Nope, not enough. Dagon out of smiles. Good choice. Good choice, my friend. Not able to get the on the bottom. Come on, the mid racks. Whoop, let's move up a little bit. C69 is in trouble, and Barco does get away. 
don't know what, what, hurt sh what hurt shadow demon so much there, but they do get away. We see a blink dagger out on tree, of course, natural. We do see the ag scepter completed on Luna, and hopefully we're gonna see some barracks. That'd be awesome. We see the mana leak on Luna for no reason. Oh, Am I damage! Forsaken? That blast does. What? Channel time of five seconds and. Oh, he's channeling it again. Which means I don't know how much it does. Um, damage per second, 10. So, five seconds is 500 damage. Holy cow. Let's hope they have number five. All right, so it looks like we're going to have a game number two with five players. Again, I don't know. I'm, I'm not 100% clear of the rules. I don't really care. I'm going to cast it. I just want to cast something. So mid lane, four players banging away at each other with Luna split pushing. That's the name of the game. Uh, it's going to only be three this time. And this axe, does he have any damage yet? Now, he has a blade mail, so that's pretty good. But there's not a lot of high damaging auto attack heroes like... All the damage from Coddle's coming. And he does finish his Ag Scepter, so this is going to be a really annoying Coddle in these fights. Um, three Shadow Poison stacks up. He needs a few more. Does he have a... Yeah, he does have Mana Boost. That'll help him quite a bit. Um, what does his Wraith King have? Just the Armbilla right now. I assume he's going... Uh, Mjolnir, maybe? Is that what he's going? Could be. Um, this Dazzle... Oh, by the way, this Dazzle does have the Dazzlator. Good choice, my friend. I also have that item. It's a pretty sweet item. Let's take a look. The Dazzlator. Meanwhile, bottom, pushing in. Uh, Kai Kamikaze has his Blink Dagger up, taking a lot of damage from the creeps, but it's going to heal back with this Leech Seed, which is always nice. Um, they ping on him. Axe wants to go. He's a little afraid. I would be afraid too. There's the blank. Oh There's the pull. Head. Pulls him back towards his team. There's the dazzle slow. There's the uh, blade mail up. There's the dunkaroo. Dazzle. Oh nope, dazzle here gets it. Big plays. Radiance mid towers getting banged up. Um, they're gonna get the racks mid though. Racks number two. Uh, I think. Yeah, they are. The oh, here comes the courier. They can just kill that. Structures. Well played, courier Three. death. Meanwhile, axe does get a. A pull on Mr. Clean. Oh, it's not gonna matter though. He's a heal. He's gonna get away. Radiant's bottom um, tower. Trying to get his bottom days. tower. Uh, mid ranks ain't doing so. You see a fortification. Uh, no no breaking down up. the radiant structures like firepower. this. And most of the right side of the tower ain't uh, a pretty sight right King, now. But ain't quite looking good for the dyer's mid ranks. Semi carry tree. Radiant's bottom tower. We did the blink pull ready for axe. Blink pull. Uh, there's a few right clicks, there's a soul catcher, but a stun them right out on the dazzle. So there's the back wall. Oh, it's gonna be some deeps. He turns on the armlet. On Shadow Demon is gonna be able to do it. No, Dazzle might go down here. Does not go down. We do see an axe pull saving his team. Uh, oh, and there goes one on Wraith King, but they might be able to smile in the back end. Big blast comes through. Yeah, he's just gonna die. Meanwhile, here we see uh, the axe pull. Um, it's going to be enough, though. That's the question. Radiant's you see the, the blast, the blast coming out? Yes. Oh, it's not enough. The stun is disjointed. Uh, Sat is running bottom with his Shadow Demon. It's going to be able to get away. No problem. Axe also able to get away. So Radiant's they lost two banged up. for a tower. Not the best trade. Oh, there's the Mana Leak. Are they going to be able to get her, though? Yeah, they're going to be able to get her. No question. There's the Blast. The Blast is going to hit her, I think. That's a massive amount of damage. And three hit points. Mid -tower three hit points hand. she survives with. What a play. And Django's going to go down here. The big stun. The Blast is not going to be enough. There's the Mana Leak, though. This is the secondary stun. The Vacuum. Babe. And that's going to be it. Barco a soldier's Keeping death. the light, carrying the game here with his blink dagger. Uh, stun comes out. Holy oh, damage by the Wraith King. Uh, this is going to be the death of number three. A uh, blasted uphill. Good blast. Uh, stun comes out. There's the Pylai Dai Leech Seed. I don't know what to call Radiance mid tower coming apart. Um, this tower, obviously not killable. I don't really know what their plan is because they have none of the other. Radiance mid towers get one tower in fact. Base race time. Yes. Bottom towers getting the business. There's the uh, blind. 
Um, trying to lose the mana. He's gonna lose it all. He's gonna stun himself. Um, so he doesn't the have enough for a TP now. That was about that maybe a little tower. mistake, my friend. Oh, the blast comes through. He actually lets it hit him. That's um, so much damage. Does he have a dig? He has Guess nothing. Uh, he's gonna need to take him out. He does have blinding light, though. Uh, blind him. Blind him. Blind him. Somebody's and he goes roll. down. How about that? Jago, really we should have seen that coming. Meanwhile, on this side of the base base, they just come in in time to get this massive back. Why are they all stunned? I don't really know. Uh, oh, they got pulled into Axe and Axe died. <laughs> so the least he might kill him here. No, Axe flies back, it's a pull, and goodbye, DHs. Um, uh, so there's the five act. Luna's gonna be able to get the tier four, happening. no problem. These guys do not have five. Radiance mid towers in trouble. Where's five back? There it is. Luna goes in. What damage? What terrible, terrible damage? Oh, she gets back to the fountain. Oh, she might go down. She goes down. She does go down. That's four in a row. Luna's things ain't looking bright for Radiance Ancient. You do catch Jago in the jungle line. He's on a killing spree, so if you're gonna be able to get this guy, that's gonna be a lot of gold to whoever gets him. Um, unless he kills Dazzle first. Get a load of the Ancient over on the Radiant side. Oh, what damage! And uh, does he have? No, he doesn't. Oh, he uh, grave TPs. Looks like Radiant Ancient is getting stomped. Oh, Too bad. Try to get this Ancient. Smiles is gonna TP in. Oh, the, the uh, blink in by uh, Kai Kamikaze, Radiant but Axe is there, there's the ultimate, uh, it's big damage coming out, but it's not going to be enough. There's uh, the blink in by the uh, Wraith King, but it's not going to matter. Um, Sad is going to get out, it looks like a buyback from Jago, but holy damage, he gets the right clicks coming from me as Jago. Uh, but Bar Barcode's going to die here yet again, I think. Nope, they're able to get the Ancient first, and that's going to be GG. For game number zero, this game does not count. It was a forfeit for W, but they decided to play it anyway. So the 4 v 5 game is over, and I can go back to casting real Dota. This is Have No Pity, and I will see you guys for game two in just a second. <laughs>